Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Alexis Clemens. Well, if you look at your calendars, it's going to say October 1st, but you step outside, it's going to feel a little bit more like July 1st. A very warm start to October today, tomorrow and Tuesday. So the first three days of the month expected to be in the 80s. However, we have some cold fronts that are going to pass through the area Wednesday through Friday. Some rain chances are going to return and look at this next weekend. I expect us to be about 30 degrees cooler than what we're seeing right now. That'll put us in the 50s by the time uh, we get towards Wisconsin homecoming. We'll get there in just a second, but let's start with what you're seeing right now out the door. This is your look from UW Madison eastward towards downtown. That sunrise starting to come up, but still pretty dark out there. 65 currently in Madison, 72 in Baraboo, 70 in Camp Douglas, sitting at 66 in Lone Rock, 60 in Watertown and Juneau. As we go through your day, I do expect us to warm to 85 degrees. Yesterday, the last day of September was 84, just a, de a degree warmer for today. Lots of sunshine through the day. A few clouds here and there. You might be wondering, is this breaking any records? This is a very, very warm start to October. I don't think we're going to break any records. The warmest October 1st in Madison, that was 90 degrees set back in 1976. We're at a forecast of 85, which of course uh, will likely end up in the top five, but likely not going to break any records there. Let's take a look back at September, though. The hottest temperature we saw was on the third of the month, 94 degrees. 42 was the coolest on the 14th, the wettest one inch of rain that we saw just a few days ago on the 26th. Warm temperatures, though, we were four and a half degrees above average. That puts us at the 12th warmest September on record for rainfall. Three inches, just a little below average for September. We're still, of course, seeing drought conditions in southern Wisconsin, but we talked about it yesterday. Nobody in the in the area is under an exceptional drought, so that's good news there. So we are still just a little bit warmer on average for the year so far and a little below average for precipitation uh, on the year so far. But we do have rain chances on the way, but I think they're going to hold off until Wednesday. Wednesday afternoon, that's your best chance for rain, but I do think rain chances will linger into Thursday and Friday as well. Temperatures slowly plummet. We're going to see highs in the mid 50s towards next weekend. So plan ahead for Wisconsin's homecoming game. Probably want to have those long sleeves out there after those rain chances later on this week.